Hi guys, welcome to the same video show with me, your host Sean. My wife mentioned you probably prefer it if my face was covered more often, so here I am. If you find any of today's entertainment helpful, don't forget to hit that lovely like button. It helps with the YouTube algorithm and getting the video out to more people. If you haven't hit subscribe button yet don't forget to hit it and the bell notification you'll be notified when a new video gets uploaded now on with the show uh, sorry i'm filming some of these outside but i figured such a lovely day and it's when i get the news i get the news and i try when I as soon as it's validated I want to get it out to you now by validated I don't mean by the company you know what else I just mean by the source that is good enough for me that doesn't mean it's true it just means it's a source that I've used in the past and has been correct in the past now giving you a dividend stock well, I'll give you a couple of them the first one is going to be Abbey and the reason why is it has reason why it is it has a uh, been be beaten down the past couple of years because of the it's humor drug it's coming to the end of its patent life and what it did was it threw a load of patents at it to try and tie up the loss of patency and then you had a uh, class action suit against it as a result. The problem is when a drug loses its patent, what happens is you, a generic drug company like Hikma Pharmaceuticals will come in and sell a drug that is selling for $120 for $5. And, and then the forces the, the drug company that developed it to reduce their price so it went before a federal judge and in an antitrust law case and they found in favour of Abby. So now their patent is safe until 2023. At the moment, its price target is between 115 and 125, depending on which broker. This news hits, it will be raised again. So, in my opinion, anything under $100 is going to be worth it. Picking up gives a good dividend so if I was you I'd jump on it longer the series is out the higher the price will go up so you would get a good dividend and you would get the growth then second one is going to be Pexico I mentioned it time and time again and the reason for it is the reason for it is diversity and coca-cola couldn't make a profit then when coca-cola couldn't make a profit then uh, Pepsi could because of all its snacks business then, uh, then and again it gives a great dividend and 
it, it said it's not ruling out share buybacks, but I think it's more likely to put the money into acquisitions. But either way, it's one that you'll keep for five, ten years, and it will pay you. Jacob! Jacob! Okay. Now, one that I would consider putting a small amount into it would be as a trial I'm going to work out and try and consider putting into Planet 13 that Jeremy from Financial Education has put a lot in and he has put more in and that's not the reason why but as a trial just to set, put a small amount in just to see if not him moving the market but but him and his followers see if his followers are blindly following his advice or if they're doing it due diligence because him putting 30 or 50k into a stock wouldn't move a stock we saw with NAT after he'd done his videos how much it, it went up. But when you have two channels with that many subscribers, if each one of them put $100 on, and we know some of them put thousands of dollars in, then that would move a stock. And then, as I said it before, when the robot investors catch wind of this, they would move a stock. So. The problem is, you can't do it on something like Weeball, Free Trade, Robinhood, Trading212, or Stake. You need to actually open an account with Fidelity to trade it. So, I'm going to look into that and I'm going to do that. Anyway, don't forget to leave me a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.